F-35 replacement. Airbus reveals details about 6th generation stealth fighter. In the spring, France's Dassault Aviation and European Aerospace Consortium Airbus announced an agreement on the future combat air system, FCAS, a combat platform aimed at replacing existing Rafale, Eurofighter, and F-18 Hornet fighter aircraft in European Air Forces. The FCAS's name comes from a 2012 Franco-British agreement on the creation of a platform based on base systems and Dassault unmanned stealth demonstrators. However, the UK's decision to pull out of the EU has now called the UK's defence cooperation prospects with continental Europe into question. Last week, London gave base systems a one-year contract for work on the FCAS, but offered no further details, including the value of the contract or the exact nature of the work. According to preliminary reports, a flight demonstrator of the Continental European FCAS project announced in April should be ready by 2025, with 2040 set as the goal for the plane's entry into service. However, with concrete implementation dates not yet determined, and the project itself surrounded by uncertainty, as far as member countries are concerned, the project's fate remains uncertain. Replacement for the F-35 The Lockheed Martin F-35 Lightning II stealth multi-role fighter is marketed as a plane developed by the US in cooperation with other countries, most prominently the UK, but also Italy, the Netherlands, Norway, and Denmark, as well as Canada, Turkey, and Australia. However, as defense analyst and journalist Dmitry Drozdenko explained, Lockheed remains by far the biggest financial beneficiary, keeping the lion's share of profits in the US. According to Drozdenko, London's possible involvement in the Franco-German project is a matter of competing for a technologically advanced system that may prove highly lucrative. When France and Germany speak about a plane of their own, it is to be understood that they will be creating it for themselves, and that the money will remain in these countries. The UK, in my view, is trying to jump on a train that has already left the station, he said. Drozdenko views the declared first flight and production dates as possibly too ambitious, given the difficulty in creating a system of this kind. The analyst noted that while a test flight may occur by 2040, their introduction by this date is unlikely, given that the plane remains in the project stage. At the moment, the United States, China, and Russia are the only countries in the world with advanced fifth-generation fighter designs. Along with the Europeans, China, and the US have also announced their pursuit of sixth-generation platforms. Russia has also announced plans to develop a sixth-generation fighter, with the Mikoyan MiG-41 interceptor aircraft reportedly under development by the aerospace company.